Okay, this is how you uh, roll the mortar. First thing you need to do, hold the trowel correctly. See my thumb is facing the heel, and then the toe, the trowel, sometimes. Well, let go of that and hold it like this. What happens is you then tighten the knuckles up and you lose that grip that way. It ends up straining on the ligaments. If you put your thumb there, it prevents that, which makes it much easier to hold the trowel with the weight on it. You're not straining as much. So I've got the uh, mortar here, compo, lime and sand. And uh, for the first lessons, what we do is we train how to roll the mortar. You slice off exactly the amount you need. Put it under the tray for you. Roll it with one so and you pick it up using the side of the trail, never this way, it's always from the side. Pick it up like so. Then you can see the toe of my trail is probably a centimetre away from the board. When I do this flicking action, slice off the top, then I furrow through, and then I cut, which leaves that to lay brick. You always follow through that allows when the brick is being laid, it creates a suction for the brick and it holds the brick firmer. So you're just slicing off and you have that rolling technique. There you go using the side of the trowel, pick it up and then you have that flicking technique and cut off the top, cut it there and then furrow through. There you go, and that's where you lay your brick. There is another way as well. That's, that's normally the fastest way. If you're laying bricks to a line when you're in a hurry on price work, that's the quickest way. There is another way where you can pick it up. Let's go this way. You can use the toe of the trowel where you can flatten it out. This takes the air out of it, you have to be more precise, get it down to about 12 mil. And then you furrow through by slicing, putting the trowel, the tip of the toe of the trowel in and turning it slightly and causing that as a furrow. Go through that again. Just watch it slowly, I'm slicing off. side of the trowel, turn the trowel over sometimes, trowel through if you want, you'll start your own technique. Slice it through, rub the mortar, side of the trowel, and then flick. I'm going to cut the top off. Slice off exactly the amount you need. Just under the trail for you. Roll it back like so. And you pick it up using the side of the trail, never this way, it's always from the side. Pick it up like so. Then you can see the toe of my trail is probably a centimetre away from the board. When I do this flicking action, slice off the top. I furrow through and then I cut, which leaves that to lay the brick. You always furrow through that allows when the brick is being laid, it creates a suction for the brick and it holds the brick firmer. So you're just slicing off and you have that rolling technique. using the side of the trowel, pick it up and then use that flicking technique and cut off the top, cut it there and then furrow through. There you go and that's where you lay your brick.
there is another way as well. That, that's normally the fastest way if you're laying bricks to a line when you're in a hurry on price work. That's the quickest way. There is another way where you can pick it up. Let's go this way. And you can use the toe of the trowel where you can flatten it out. This takes the air out of it, you have to be more precise, get it down to about 12 mil. And then you furrow through by slicing, putting the trowel, tip of the toe of the trowel in and turning it slightly and pulling that as a furrow. Go through that again. Just watch it slowly, I'm slicing off. Side of the trowel, turn the trowel over sometimes, throw it through if you want. You'll fill up your own technique. Slice it through, rub the water, side of the trowel, and then flick. I'm going to cut the top off. and butter your first break. <laughs> 